everyone. Um, my name is Meg Ball, camp name Smalls. I am the Central Oregon High School mentor and young adult advocate with Caldera. And today I would like to share a lesson with y'all on how to make these paper flowers out of an egg carton. Um, so what you'll need for this project is an empty egg carton, a pair of scissors, and some glue. This is just what I have on hand. Um, and the first part of the project is you take your egg carton and you will want to cut this off. It's just easier to cut with it off. So you will have this side. Um, you will need two of these, so you'll cut them right, you'll make a cut right here. So then you'll have this part of the egg carton, and then you're gonna half that, so cut between those two. And cut off any extra. So it will look like uh, this right now at this point. And you want it to get to where you have like four petals. So like four. So you may need to cut um, them out. So just making a, a triangle cut. So then you have four sections, one here, 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 and here. And doing the same, this one didn't come out um, very well. So we're just gonna cut to make four sections. Where it looks like this. So you'll have two that look like these, kind of identical. Um, one you're just going to be, is going to be the outside part of the flower and the other is gonna be the inside. So you're just going to round out these a little bit. So I'm just rounding a little bit more. So they look, they look like petals. And if you need to, you can continue to, um, so this one doesn't, isn't as deep, so I'm just continuing to cut this triangle a little bit further down. To where it looks like this. And then I'm gonna take the second one, the other half, uh, and do the same, but cut it down a little bit more. Cause this one's gonna be the inside of the flower, so it's gonna be a little bit smaller it in a triangle as needed. And you'll, once you get the hang of it, you'll gauge like how much you want to cut down after the first flower that you make. Um, I've made a couple, so I've kind of got the skill down. So that one's a little bit round, rounded, like that. So they, at this point, they'll look like this. Then, like I said, you'll decide which one uh, will be the in 
side part of the flower so you'll have this this part right here or and the outside so i'm gonna take this one to be the inside and i'm going to cut cut right here all the way down to the bottom so i'm gonna cut that just in a straight line like that so you'll have an opening right there and what you do next is you're gonna cut out this circle area or the bottom of this flower into a circle open now kind of like a crown and here you can um continue to cut down a little bit more since this is the inside spot like i said it's going to be smaller than the other section And then at this point, if you were to color uh, your flowers, um, either with pen, marker, paint, um, you I think it would be easiest to do at this point. Um, so you don't have to color it when it's all put together because it have, will have glue and such on it. So then you take it from here and I like to roll it. Kind of like looks like this and then just squeeze a little bit around just to kind of round it out so then it'll be looking like that and then the out one well, outer layer I just kind of clean it up a little bit you're just going to set this in here so then you take your glue, glue, um, if you have tape, it'll work. Um, I think that it would work with like if you had piano polish, um, but also if you didn't have any of those on hand. So I'm just gonna dab some glue on the bottom of this smaller one. It's kind of rolled up still. And I'm just going to put that right there and hold it down and just pinch it a little bit. And then I'm just going to press these flower petals out a little bit more so it makes the flower look a little bit fuller. Just hold it. Just kind of, I'm just kind of pressing it to, for the glue to kind of set in. And that's how you make a paper flower out of an egg carton. Um, like I said, you can color them however you would like. I used pen for these just because I had a pen and a sharpie on hand, and I also have paint on hand, so I painted that to look a little more like a rose. Thanks for watching. I hope that y'all try this. And if you do, feel free to share it with Caldera Arts on Instagram or our Facebook page. Um, yeah, I hope y'all are well and I'll talk to you later.